Loser buys donuts. You're on. Three, two, one. Woo! Go, go, go! Ah! <laughs> 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 Woo! 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 Hit the snow pile! You pushed me off the tracks! I wouldn't be you for sure! I want a rematch! Three, two, one! Woo no, 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 what happened, Phil? I may have taken a dumb one. You know what they say, Big D? All is fair in racing toboggans down a hill. Yeah. Pretty sure it's not what they say. It is what they say today. And as you can see, guys, the snow has fallen. The sun is out. The skies are blue. It is beautiful out. Really, Phil? It's pretty cold out. I don't get cold. I'm made out of steel. That doesn't even make any sense. It's currently 1-1. One, one. I'll see you back at the top. For all the marbles. See you at the bottom. Oh! <laughs> Oh, that is a tiny bit ahead of me. Like I said, Big Z, all is fair in winter tobogganing. But Big Z, that's enough tobogganing for today. Because today, me and you are setting out on our most crucial adventure. I stayed up all last night, and I cannot wait to tell you the information I've gathered. I'm not another one of your crazy adventures. I wanted to have a nice tobogganing day. This one's going to be different, I promise. Also, Papa Jake and Logan are never going to believe us once we're successful. Successful? What is he talking about? And if you two like tobogganing down snowy hills and coming on adventures with me and Big Z, then what are you waiting for? Hit that subscribe button and join the most awesome fam on YouTube. <laughs> Oh, oh yeah, Izzy, you owe me donuts. Shoot. No, 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 Phil. We are literally not doing that. That is one of the craziest ideas you've actually ever had, I think. It might be the craziest idea I've ever had. It's also the best idea I've ever had. And it is going to make us famous. Famous, Phil? It's never been done before. What makes you think we're going to find it? Also, take your boots off. Of course it's never been done before, Big Z. That's the best part. That's what's going to make us famous. You can't be famous if you're lost in the woods forever. I'm sure you have one of these amazing plans. But you know the problem about your plans? is they always have holes in them. There ain't any holes in this plan, Big Z. This plan is over. There is nothing on the piece of paper. Well, I was going to start writing it there, and then I thought to myself, if you put the pen to the paper, someone might be able to steal your ideas. So I'm keeping them all up here for right now. That might be the dumbest thing you have ever said. Who would want to steal this idea? No one would even think about doing it. Also, you have to return the U-Haul right now. The U-Haul's already paid for for the next 48 hours. I am not returning it. I put down a big down payment on that thing. Those things are $25.99 a day. You eat about $100 in donuts a day. Ah, uh, most of the time, Bob Jake pays for them. Tell, tell, why are you going downstairs? Well, most of the gear's down here. No gear, no gear. Why don't you let the Phil fam decide how crazy this idea is and if we should really do it? Oh, I know the Phil fam's gonna be on board. I stayed up all last night Googling and putting together as much information and knowledge in my head as possible about the abominable snowman. You can't even say the word right. The abominable snowman. Abominable, abominable. It doesn't matter, Big Z. I know everything about him. And considering we had a massive snowfall in our area yesterday, means this is the time he is most active. Oh, that's not a good thing. Oh, yes it is, Big Z. Yes it is. Here, grab this. What? Oh. What is this, Phil? What are we preparing for? You don't think we're going to be taking down a snowman with our bare hands, do you? I wasn't planning on taking down a snowman at all. Oh, mighty was I, Big Z, but desperate times call for desperate measures. And this, this is a desperate time. Only oh, have two hands, Phil. Why are you grabbing seven weapons? And we're not going mining for gold, Phil. Okay, the pickaxe can stay. But I'm keeping the saw, I'm keeping the crowbar, and I'm definitely keeping this shovel. So why do we need a shovel? You never know when you need a good shovel. Yes, shovels are for specific purposes. I usually know when I need to have a shovel. Well, you never chase an after abominable, abominable, abominable snowman before. Oh boy. Oh, wait, wait, wait. I'm forgetting the most crucial item we need to bring. And make sure it's back. Ooh, you're trapping the wrong person. I'm not the abominable snowman. I'm trying to help you. Also, why so much netting? Why so much netting? Because this monster is six foot five, 450 pounds, Big Z. That's why so much netting. I think we're gonna need a bigger backpack. All right, it looks like we're almost ready. Okay, I'm coming. 
Just in case. No biggie. We are going to need some food for this adventure. Never know how long we're going to be out there for. What do you mean you don't know how long we're going to be out there for? Well, it's not like he's just going to be there ready for us to catch him. Probably going to be hidden. Also, from the little research I've done, they're nocturnal. They actually only come out at night. Don't eat our food. You're eating our food right now. But it's different. I skipped lunch. Well, that's not a good idea because we ain't eating dinner tonight. I have no idea what you just said. <laughs> I said, that's not a good idea because we ain't eating dinner tonight. No dinner? Uh huh. I have pizza at home. I was wrong. I forgot a tent downstairs. We might have to camp out. That is where I draw the line. I am not camping out in the middle of the forest in the middle of winter. When all we have is a net, a shovel, and one chewy bar to fight over. Oh, Phil, Phil, before you go out that door, Lass, come on, what if we just stay and play Minecraft? You're not staying and playing Minecraft. Today's the day me and you finally get what we deserve. The respect from Papa Jake and Logie. I know we've messed up in the past, but this is the time, Bixie. This is it. You, me, capturing the abominable snowman. Papa Jake and Logan have gone after Bigfoot multiple times. And yes, they've seen him, but they've never actually captured him. We are going to change that today and capture our monster. No, your tent already broke. And second of all, I've never seen someone so happy hitting the gritty while literally putting them in the most dangerous situation possible. It's all about perspective. Oh boy. This is gonna be an adventure if I've ever seen one. I call it Bessie. Cause this right here is gonna be the vehicle in which we carry the snowman back to the YouTube house. You think this is gonna stop a 450 pound monster? We've got wood, metal. What else could we need? I don't know, maybe a cardboard? That's genius. When we do catch this Mongo snowman, if he's just in the back of the car, he might escape. But he won't escape if we put our cardboard prison in here that we built to catch Jumbo Josh. Well, you're lucky I'm here, or this mission would have already been a failure. That's why I got you, Big Z. You're my right hand man. None of this would be possible without you. All right, Big Z, this was your idea. You're going to help me with this scene or what? I'm coming, Phil. Count of three. One, two, three. <laughs> Just lift this up, go run right in, and we'll take him back to Papa Jake and Logan. Again, I'm not sure that's a present that Papa Jake and Logan are gonna want. What do you mean? He's been chasing after Bigfoot for years. Why not add a bottle of snowman to the trophy shelf? Because it's a massive monster that will want to try and attack us every day. So negative. Hey, hey let me out. Go, let me out of here. Look, Phil, you really want to be out here right now? Warning, no winter maintenance. It's time to turn back. We only just got here. Also, it says cyclists dismount. We're not even on bikes. No dots cycling dismounts. We're going over a bridge. I don't even know how sturdy this bridge is. It's the middle of winter. Maybe the metal's frozen and it's gonna collapse any second. Do not put things like that in the universe. Do not put bridges that we are standing on falling into the universe. You know what we should put into the universe though? Let me guess, Phil. Finding the abominable snowman. Exactly. Now come on, on the Google Maps that I pulled up earlier on our way here, it says the last abominable snowman sighting was somewhere in these woods, but much deeper into these woods. Not like right here. Right here would be real nice. That sighting was four years ago. Where do you get your research from? Four years is better than the first article I read. It said 20 years ago. What? Oh my goodness, Phil, stop running! This Yeti isn't gonna catch itself. Phil fam, this might be the most excited I have ever been for one of our adventures together. I mean, catching a real life Yeti, topping Papa Jake and Logan. They've chased after Bigfoot so many times. Been oh, unsuccessful. Yeti! Yeti! What do you mean, Yeti? Yeti! Let's go! Oh, this is awesome! We're not going back, Yeti! We're not going back! 